What's up? I'm over here at the shop right now. Hell yeah. I was supposed to be here an hour ago, but he needed a haircut. Cause he going to the board. So I had to come through. I wasn't about to do it though. <laughs> but I had to come through. And the boys came in. About to go ahead and mount these boys. The time machine is not at the house no more. So yeah, so about to go get the 30s. The bones. Yeah, we call them 30s. Well, I'm from Chicago. 30 spokes. I'm about to go get them boys. Loki Bear over here. She said, can I go if you're not staying long? You having fun? You crazy. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's go get uh, the blue car so I can get the wheels. Come on. It's time for my babies. It's time. I wonder if I'm going to have some problems with this pit, but I hope not. Yes, sir. Ooh. It's time. It's almost time for them. I said, like, another one, I should be these. But these would I'm going to ride, so I won't scratch my tires. I need brand new 28s. I ain't trying to do no damage like the 26s, but let me get my stuff. A whole bunch of spares. These some brand new uh, torn tires for my van. Y'all know, I used to tow the van, man. So. Stocks. Wheels for the Tahoe. White ATV. Let me get these wheels up out of here though. Real, real made. Hey, this shit nice. This shit nice. Ain't cap. Man, I bought all four of these for $180 and I never played with it. Till y'all seen that video. I made the box like two years ago, never played with it. So I got an APFT tomorrow, so I, I can't do too much. I'm kind of tired, and uh, I got to save my energy for tomorrow. So tomorrow after PT, I'll be over here. I want lunch, I'll be over here getting in. So I'm just doing something light. I always try to do something every day, every day. Try to do something. Today, I replaced the window in the house. Um, and then after PT, I went to Home Depot and picked up the window. So I'm just going to mount these tires and then cut holes for the speaker box over here. And then uh, that'd be it for me for a little while. I'll just be working on everybody else's stuff. Uh, but yeah, about to get these boys on real quick. Let me the camera. All right, y'all know these rims, man. About 30 years old. So they got some pitting. I'm going to just use this wire brush. Try to clean it up a little bit. Valve stems don't look all that bad. I do have replacements just in case, but they ain't cracked or nothing. And they uh, got the chrome on it. So I'm going to leave them in there. Uh, I got... Get in here. It's about to rain. I got a paintbrush for an applicator because I can't find my brush. So I'm just going to go ahead and get them on and then uh, go over there, cut these speaker holes and get up. There. <laughs>
Hey man, came out magnificent. Can't wait to mount these boys. It's like another style of riding, man. So I might need some bead chiller. Some of that pitting was a little like past the surface, so I might have to go get some bead chiller if it don't seal. But I mean, I think it should be good. I had this happen before and I just resealed it with more slip tack. But uh, the slip tack that they sent with this tire machine, man, it ain't all that. I don't even think I got it over here. It's over here, but it's not here. It's usually sitting right up in this. I don't think I got it. So, worst case scenario, I just get some seat, some bead sealers, like $10 on you know, eBay. And I should be able to do a few sets of rims for it, with it. But this will be the first set if I have to buy it. But other than that, man, that's it. The boys clean.